There's your basket star. Basket star! star. Oh, basket star, yep. You want to see around. Three in a line, look at that. So let me zoom on Nail it. Gosh, those are cool. He's all curled up. So basket stars are in the same group as brittle stars. They're a type of brittle star, but touch down. much, That's much, much applause. bigger. Looks a lot more like a plant. Kinda, Does that prefer yeah. hard it bottom like and it's just in the wrong roots. area or what? Um, Fell off? I Drifted? Think, uh, when I usually see them, they're perched on top of something. Right. Um, so they can move Either around. a rock or a coral or something. Right. So that, that might have may have strayed from whatever see perch that. it was sitting on. See a basket star basket there star. at the bottom of frame. Big you gorgeous sea fan. You ready? Pressure, this is now. Can we get the ship to move on bearing 270, 20 meters? Some itty bitty corals in there. Yeah, that red one was Adelogorgia. We'll be collecting, uh, we have a quota of eight of those we're hoping to get. Eight of the little red ones? Dive. Yeah, eight of these little red ones. Four in each of the two compartments of the forward bio box. Thank you, Rich. Right now, the, the basket, basket stars, stars are everywhere. And yeah. see that big kelp fall right there? That's Macrocystis kelp. It's fallen down from shallower. And then that's a nice source of food for all these things down here. Uh, Pete, I also have a selfish request um, for the production side of things. If at some point, whenever we're doing a sample, if there's a uh, basket star that we can get a zoom in on, uh, I know the production team at URI would like to have that. So just, you know. We don't need to stop, but. Well, now's a good time because uh, we just reached the end of transect yep. one. So There's why don't we right do there. that? Can we park in front of this uh, this basket star here on the left? Oh zoom man, zoom ask in. and you shall receive. <laughs> yeah. So sure. how did they uh, get the name basket star? I think when they open their arms out to be trying to catch um, their prey, they can have more of the appearance of a basket. Uh, oh, okay. But then if yeah. they're right. not actively feeding or they're trying to defend themselves, they kind of um, pull their arms in and Shall um, I copy look the like a basket that got Video crunched. Push in. Very neat. Oh, okay. Yeah. Data auto Once you're happy fit? with Argus, go ahead on Herc, push all the way in, we'll get a good so focus. It should be okay. a okay. shale, right? Okay. And then slowly come out to frame it. Right. Are those or? No, I can't get it. Okay, that. Uh, this one has its arms outstretched a little more than the Video other. Video, let's push in. Let's get a good focus. You can see a few uh, cup corals in and around. Th those are little animals, actually. Some of the simplest organisms on Earth after the sponges. So they're the just kind of all over the sea four point. Uh, The Wait, the lasers? They're little animals, nice. actually. Some mm -hmm. of the simplest organisms on Earth after the sponges. So the laser kind of should be two point or four point. The wait, the lasers or that? Yes, you can see like four points sometimes. Oh, it's just because it, it catches on the. I see. Okay. It's not a crinoid he has his hand on. Yeah, that's a crinoid behind it. Another type of. Thing. Basket star beauty shots. <laughs> it looks like they're reacting to the currents uh, generated by the ROV as we approach. They seem to. You know, retract. But uh, uh, if you look as we fly over them, most of them have their arms fully uh, outstretched. They're filtering food from the water column. Yeah, it's starting to unravel a little bit, maybe. Seems like there's a lot of surface area when they actually fully uh, stretch out. That they're they're pretty big. I got many shots. Nice little stair step we have right here. Another copper rockfish on the right. Flag rockfish on the left. Lots of crinoids here. Starting to see a little more relief, a little more elevation in the seafloor. Mm -hmm. Grand staircase. Ren Those Ren Ren do you have a footprint on that? The no. end of the tether here. Nice. Oh man, those are so cool. I like nice how it's. I like how it's diffusing. It's the not up right now, but it's in. I think it's in here somewhere. Yeah. Really so we're south of Footprint. Yeah, it's somewhere, somewhere here. These are basket stars perched on the edge of a sponge. I'd pull it up, but every time I try to bring up the target editor, it keeps crashing, so I'm avoiding that at the moment. Rennie, 
Yes. Can you just draw a line six nautical wow. miles off of? I'm sorry. Could you say that again? Just draw a line six nautical miles off of uh, the south side of Santa Cruz Island. That'll give us the second. southern boundary of the footprint. 